Hey, happy uh, Wednesday. It is Wednesday. Yes, it is hot. It is so hot. It's 86 degrees, and I just finished mowing the yard, and my hair's wet because I just took a shower, and my, my damn hair's almost dry. Shit, I just walk outside, and my hair's about dry. Woo! Yes, so I am in a better mood today than I was yesterday. Um, it's not that I was in a bad mood yesterday. I wasn't in a bad mood. It was just, you know, I'm just, I'm burnt out. I'm burnt out, and I just don't want to do videos at this point. But I did think of an idea today. I thought of it, I thought of it this morning while I was brushing my teeth. I thought, you know what we should do? We should go to Family Dollar and just walk around in there and make a video. We haven't been in a Family Dollar in a while. And there was music playing in there and it was kind of loud. So <clears throat> I had to do a voiceover for it, but that's not, that's not a big deal or anything. So I did that and I edited the video and it's processing and I had to get out and uh, I mowed the front yard and then I took a shower and um, I went to a class this morning. I've been pretty busy all day. I've been busy with this, that, and the other. And oh, also, hang on a minute. I'm going to sneak up on, we're going to Costco. I'm sneaking up on it. I'm going this way today because I feel like it. We're sneaking up on the Costco. Going to sneak up on it. We're going this way. Um, I went back and forth with my new employer, the HR people. They have everything they need and all the checks came back clear. Everything's good. And I have a start date. I know when I'm going to start work. May 1st is my start date. May Day. May Day. I get to be a lady of leisure for what? Another third? What is today? What is today? I don't know. For like another week and a half or so, I have time to myself. So, I'm just going to carry on like I've been doing until May 1st. And then May 1st, I get to start my new job. So it's all set. It's all ready to go. That will be my official start date. And the funny thing is, the firm I worked for for 18 years, my, my start date was May 1st on that job as well. That's pretty funny. May 1st was my start date there as well. It's pretty crazy. Um, what are they building out there? Damn. Oh, it's got to be apartments. Got to be what that is. Sorry. So, I'm, I'm taking the back roads to Costco. I have a prescription to pick up. And my son, my younger, my older son's at work. My younger son's at home. He wanted me to get a pizza. So, I guess I'll get a pizza. Oh, and he wanted a churro. I said, we'll see. I might get one. Shit, was I supposed to turn there? Oh, I think I was. I think I was supposed to turn. We'll go into Longhorn Steakhouse and go around our ass to get to our elbow. What happens if you go this way? Well, if you go this way, you come behind whatever the hell that is. There's the steakhouse. I got a truck on my ass. That is Red Lobster. This is a road. And this road leads to a man that looks like Walter White. And he's walking down the road. There is the liquor store. There's Bojangles. Oh, I need to go. Well, shit, I can't get there from here. Why can I not get there from here? Now, hang on a damn minute. No, no, this is not what I wanted. That's Bassett Furniture. I'm going to have to go around my ass again. Hold on. We got to go this way. All right, hold Hang on a minute. You know what you do? You, uh, you turn here on Lanada. Lanada, Lanada, potato, potato. You go turn here and you go straight up and it will take you to a light. And then you go that way. That's what you do. So I'm feeling good. I feel better now that I know when I'm actually going to start my job. This is awesome. So that's good. Um, I need to find out some specifics before I start. Um, some little details about location, parking, just details. So hopefully I'll be able to work that out between now and then. So on the first day I'll know where to go and what to do and all that.
that good stuff. So, yes. What is that? Window tinting. I don't need any window tinting. I should have just gone the regular way. I'd probably already be there by now. So, is the IHOP just not open anymore? They're not. They got grass growing in the parking lot. They got it all chained off. Like, you can't even... Why'd they close? Yeah, it was weird. That IHOP right there. It was a strange situation. Because... Oh, something smells good. There's an IHOP right here. And it used to be so busy all the time. Especially on Sundays. Like, everybody would go there for lunch or brunch or whatever on Sundays. And that place was always packed. Well, during COVID, they closed. Like, they just weren't open. And I'm thinking that they did reopen briefly, but people just didn't come back. I guess people just got used to going elsewhere, and people just didn't go back. And now they've, they're just, it looks like they are closed. I mean, I was kind of wondering, because every time I came by here, there was just never, there were never any cars in the parking lot, and it was kind of weird. And, yeah, now they've got the parking lot just, like, chained off. Like, you can't even get in there anymore, and there's grass growing in the parking lot. So yeah, I guess they're just, they're shut. They're just shut. I wanted to check out the uh, gas pump situation up here at Costco. What are y'all doing? All right, don't be stupid. Why is everybody going to Sheets? Why is there a damn line of cars going in the Sheets? Do y'all know something I don't? Nobody is ever that eager to go to Sheets. Every damn one of these cars is going to Sheets. What are you doing? I don't know if the gas pumps are open yet or not at Costco. I guess if they're not, I'll be going to Sheets. I need to get some gas. Um, if, yeah. I know somebody told me they have that E88 gas for cheap for the rest of the month. I don't use that gas in my car. Um, it's, no. I, the only gas I ever put in my car is the Kirkland gas from Costco because I get the best gas mileage with that gas, and I don't use that E88 stuff. No. Where's that siren? Shit. Oh my God, they have, which way are you going? So, oh Lord, they have the whole damn side torn up over here. They're, they got it fenced off. Are we just not stopping at the stop sign anymore? Okay, so it's all, Lord, what are they doing over here? See, Glenda the Good Witch and I both think they're putting in chargers over here, like um, the Tesla chargers <clears throat> and maybe some other ones. So is the gas pump, is it reopened? I don't know, I'm gonna ride over there before I get out. I'm gonna go look. I'll wait for people to come through. You coming, honey? You got a cart full, you go right ahead. Oh, he bought a rose bush. It's pretty. Okay. Oh, don't, dang, you got a pizza, you go ahead. <laughs> Got your hands full, all right. So, there's a Tesla going to the gas pumps. What the hell are you doing? You don't need to go over there. That's the whole point. Plug it up. My brother has one. He got one when they first came out. I got to take a ride in it. It was, it was spiffy. I thought it was pretty cool. He offered to let me drive it. I'm like, hell no. I'm afraid I'd wreck this damn thing. So, can you get gas over here? Um, ugh, sort of. You can, but there's a line a mile long. I'm not waiting in that line. No, thank you. They still have it all. Oh, it's all torn up. Look at it. I don't know if you can see, but it's all. Yeah, no. No, thank you. I will just come back later. At any rate, I'm going to go find somewhere to park. I'm going to go in there and get my prescription. This actually works out well because I have a, a doctor's appointment one day next week and I have another appointment I want to make and it will give me time to get both of those things done before I start work so I won't have to start work and then immediately say, hey, <laughs> I need to go to these appointments. You know, I'm going to go ahead and take care of a few things if I can between now and May 1st. Just I want to get as much squared away. I should have parked right there. I still could, but I, I just think I'll keep going. I want to try to get as much squared away as I can before I start work, so I won't immediately have to be like, oh, I need a half a day off, you know.
trying to avoid that. Because <clears throat> eventually I will be working from home, I think two days a week. But they did say, you know, starting out, you know, you're going to have to come into the office every day. I said, that's, that's totally fine. Um, that is not a problem at all. All right, calm down. Jesus. Anyway, people, my experience, people around here who drive Jeeps tend to be kind of asshole -ish. Not everybody, but a lot of Jeep people are just kind of dicks. Huh? Anyway, but I just wanted to let you know, I do have an official start date. And like I said a minute ago, in the meantime, I'm just going to make, I'm going to do whatever videos I want to do. I will, I will do one a day, two a day. 10 a day, whatever I feel like doing that day, I will do. Um, if I don't feel like doing one, I won't. I'm just, cause you know, I feel better now that I actually know when I'm gonna start this job. So I have I have a date to work with here. I have a concrete date. So I feel, I feel much better now knowing that. So um, I wanted to let y'all be the first to know that I do have that. And I really look forward to it. I did find out um, my health insurance premiums, I'm probably gonna save, oh Lord, upwards of $500 a month on my insurance premiums alone just from taking this job. I'm coming out ahead already just on that. So I'm, I'm really excited. And it will be much better insurance than I have now as well, so that's even better. Woo! So, anyway, I'm going to get into Costco. I know it seems like I come here a lot. I really don't. The only times I ever come here, I end up talking to y'all, you know, while I'm here. Um, but thank you so much for watching. I, um, I do, I do have that Family Dollar video later. It's nothing special. I just wanted to walk through there. Oh, and I, I bought this, um, eyeshadow stuff. It's like a little pencil and it's retractable and I really like it. You don't have to sharpen it, you know, you just turn it. And the colors are beautiful. The colors are absolutely stunning. I might make a video with them later. I may go back and get a couple more colors. I liked them so much. And they were only $2.10 each. And they had a bunch of colors. I may go back and get some more. And we may do a video with them, like swatching them, so I can show you how pretty they are. They're they're gorgeous colors. Oh, my goodness. Because I, I, I tried them out before I was going to take all my makeup off anyway. So I played with them a little bit. Oh, they're stunning. And they're, they're LA colors, but they're they're beautiful. The color is just beautiful. So I might do that later. I don't know, maybe one day this week I'll do that. So at least for now, everything's gonna stay the same through the end of April. And then starting May 1st, everything's gonna change. And I will be making videos when I can, and I'm just gonna play it by ear. And I'm gonna have to repeat this a few times because I have people come along all the time who go, what are you talking about? You know, what do you mean? I, this is the first I'm hearing of this because everybody doesn't watch every video. So you'll probably hear me repeat it again just to let people know if you haven't heard me say it before, I'm starting a brand new job and I'm gonna be working full time and I'm not gonna be making as many videos because of that. So that's coming up. And it has been over six weeks. I haven't received any response from Google to my appeal. They have dropped my ad revenue. It hasn't changed. I still have heard nothing from them. It's still listed as pending. So maybe one day they'll respond, but so far they haven't. But thank you so much for watching. Happy Wednesday to you. I hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you again soon.